If 200 years ago our forefathers wanted candles to equal just one brightly shining light bulb for three hours every evening, it would have meant burning 17,000 candles every year. But then innovators and entrepreneurs developed gas lights and kerosene lamps, then incandescent lamps and fluorescent lamps, and now LEDs. And along the way, prices collapsed. We take it for granted, but we belong to the first generations with cheap and easy access to light when the sun doesn't shine. Artificial light for reading, working, socializing and for safety, that's long been one of humanity's greatest technological achievements. 200 years ago, candle making was labor intensive and the average person had to work almost 1000 hours a year just to afford light three hours a day. Today, it takes less than 10 minutes a year to earn the money to pay for it. It's a price reduction of more than 99.9% and it doesn't burn down the house. It is easy to forget the innovation that made it happen. We can ignore, for example, that Thomas Edison's team had to experiment with more than 6,000 materials to make a carbon filament for the light bulb. The spreading of light represents capitalism in action, constantly turning unaffordable luxuries for the few into everyday products for the many. I think it makes sense that the light bulb is still the symbol for having a brilliant idea. Hey, check out these other great videos from Free to Choose Network. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel to get updated on episodes of New and Improved with me, Johan Norberg.